Hi everyone, I hope you've had a lovely weekend and we're getting into another week. Now I've got some beautiful styling here from a gorgeous lady in the Sparkle Sisterhood. What she's done is she's put a shorter link necklace at the, at the base. There's the single strand right there. Then she's got the triple strand underneath as you can see. Then layered with a longer strand. Now the longer link necklace, sorry, has a mini connector just one mini connector in the back of it to give it that longer look then the um, shorter link uh, necklace now always turn this to the side and look in a mirror before taking them off simply because every single piece is 10 mil as is the magnet so it can be very very tricky to um to figure out which one the magnet is so better to have a look in the mirror rather than just start you know uh, what's the word uh, pulling and tugging. We don't want to be pulling and tugging the 10-way necklace range. So uh, there's the regular uh, link necklace with nothing added in. Now if you wanted more length anywhere, it's just so easy. You can actually get the single strand for example and then if you don't like it so close to the base of the neck and also I did the wrong thing there and then you can grab the other mini connector which adds about seven centimeters and pop that in. And so now everything is falling away from the base of the neck. A lot of people don't like it so close to the base of the neck uh, for many different reasons. And the good thing about the 10 way necklace range is that it's a very easy fix to change that. Now this look is going to look amazing with so many different colors. Now, for example, let's try it with the, by the way, I'm wearing the pink, uh, Japanese uh, burgundy fan, burgundy Japanese fan kimono. There you go, got it out. Now let's, in keeping with this rose gold kind of tone, let's do it with this satin rose gold this time, really highlighting the pink in my top and then adding the tricolor link necklace, which will really lend itself to really anything uh, in the satin, in, in silver, yellow gold, or rose gold, okay? You can really have this mix and lend itself to any one of those. So there you go, there's the triple strand and the link necklace. Then we can add, I just happen to have in front of me here, the bracelet in the link necklace. So you can easily uh, create a bit of a necklace look if you have the bracelet piece as well. And by the way, two connectors, and a bracelet will give you just that. So that's that look there. As you can see, just a little bit of a peekaboo from the side, not much at all. It actually looks more like a necklace as well. And then all that's left is the single strand, which you can allow to sit at the very, very top or add in another extender or connector and pop it in right there. So there's just some styling that you might think to be blending your link range of necklaces and bracelets with the rest of your 10-way necklace range as well. Oh, not to mention, by the way, let's look at just one more quick thing while we're here. You can easily get the single strand to create something different, pop in your bracelet and then Hang on a minute. We've got to be mindful about the hair, don't we, with magnetic jewelry? All right, I'll look at that. There we go. So let's now make the longer necklace shorter. So really, it's like, honestly, playing with things once you put them down, have a play, and then just keep creating different looks, different lengths, until you're completely satisfied with what you've got. 